trust you. Well, you didn't have a choice, Isaac. I told you there was a cure and you came running. Why are you doing this? Why can't everyone just leave me alone, huh? You're a dangerous secret, Isaac. EarthGov won't leave you alone because they're afraid you'll destroy their marker. After all, you did build it. What are you talking about? Well, that's why we brought you here. To build markers for us. To spread glorious convergence to the entire galaxy. You people are unbelievable! Just give me the fucking cure and let me go. No, we don't want to cure you, Isaac. We need that precious little head of yours just the way it is. Now would you escort Isaac to the shuttle and put him in stasis? The last thing we want is for him to die. Are you there? Geek, can you hear me? What do you want, Strauss? Look, it's over. All my plans just blew out the window. No, 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 it's not over. At least not yet. Isaac, Isaac, we, we build it. We can tear it down. What, you, you mean the marker? Do you know where the marker is, Strauss? It, it's in the government sector. The government sector, but we have to move now. Now, 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 because time is running out for me and for us. Strauss! Strauss, where are you going? Before we start discussing the Tormentor boss fight, I'd like to say that I do know that there are some more bosses in this game, yet I'm not going to cover them because the Brutes and Tripods fit into normal enemy encounters since there's no story reason or item they have that make them unique unto themselves, so most of the quote unquote bosses will not be in this series. Anyway, on to the Tormentor. And once again, it's unfortunate to see another game fall into the trap of halfway runtime encounters. It is a major problem for any video game that wants to do boss fights, because you have to introduce the player to the general idea of how they are supposed to work, otherwise they end up being tossed into situations they are completely unprepared for, and end up eating three failures off the bat as they try to get on the same page as the game itself. The Tormentor really doesn't do this, and is only two steps away from being a QTE boss fight. 
since the encounter consists mainly of watching the monster scream at Isaac and then searching of a way to blow it up. It's cinematic and terrifying, sure, but the second that everything is said and done and fate inevitably throws Isaac into the next chapter, you get zero satisfaction from it simply because the Tormentor is here and gone so quickly. I didn't like that you defeat the Tormentor by shooting a red barrel right next to Isaac's face instead of using Kinesis to toss it at the Tormentor, which would have made more sense using the established mechanics. But sure, game, why not admonish me for not wanting to cause an explosion two feet in front of me? That's totally fair. So this scary moment was achieved, and Dead Space 2 is quickly hurrying us along to the next set piece of terror.